Good morning. Just kidding. It's like eight o'clock at night. Probably bananas. Oh, those are big. Okay. I just want to say mosquitoes, you're not invited to my birthday party. And now I just need to remember not to touch my eyes. I also had like a bowl of cream in my face, just like making bubbles, so. Hello everybody. Easy peasy today. I want to see what we can get from the garden. I know I have an eggplant that I can harvest and one uh, chili pepper. I think it's Serrano. I need to check it. Oh, we may be able to harvest a cabbage. So we'll go see that. Okay, give me a second. Let me get my stuff. Oh, and look at this. Aren't these the prettiest? Wait, isn't that the prettiest funnel? Look at that. All of them are very pretty. A big one, big one back there. Anyways, and it's so curious that they smell like licorice. Never knew that. One eggplant, I have one eggplant. So we'll cut that. Also, these are so hard to cut. One eggplant, one eggplant. The peppers are starting to come along. See that? Nice little pepper. And there is a few over here, like right there. There's a few down there as well. So I know I have tomatoes I need to harvest, but I'm a little afraid of going in there. <laughs> we definitely have zucchinis, zugzugs as they call them. Oh, those are big, okay. You know, when zucchinis grow, you see them the one day and they're like itty bitty. And then like 20 minutes later, they're like, this size. What's wrong with them? There you go. See? I think my basket is too small. Oh, we have two over here. I don't know if you can see it. My hair is in the way. There you go. First. Oh. oh, these are so pretty. Look at that. Look at that. I'm so proud of myself. Yeah. Let's see how many zucchinis I can get, okay? I'll be right back and I'll show you. Okay, I'm back. Oh God. Three zucchinis and four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. We got 10 zucchinis and we have one eggplant so far. I'm gonna go check if we have any tomatoes. So I'll be right back and I'll show you. Totally bananas. I was too afraid to do the tomatoes because there's so many. So maybe that's a tomorrow project. But I think I have a lot of peas, like snap peas. So I'm gonna go pick those and then I'll show you how much I have. Look at this beautiful little plant here. How many it has. Isn't that cool? I need that. I mean, I grew that. I just wanna say mosquitoes, you're not invited to my birthday party. Okay, I think that's it for now. I mean, it's good enough for now. And peppers are not ready because those are red peppers. Ooh, I might have one cabbage ready. Maybe. We could see. Let's go see. Wow, wow, we have all the cauliflower up in here. And it grew really nice and then it got burnt. Now I know that I need to cover them. Oh, that's so cute. Look. Cabbage. We're still working on it. So we have one, two, three forming. What else here? Oh, four, five, oh, six cabbages. So no cabbage to harvest. But I'm actually pretty happy with the progress. This is the first year that I could grow cabbage. So that is very, very exciting in my books. We need to go check the chili pepper. I think I'll harvest some of the jalapenos and then this red one that I see. They're just like booming. Look at that. So gonna try this. Shut the front door. Wait. It's a little burned, but I'm gonna try this one too. 
And now I just need to remember not to touch my eyes. First jalapeno. And don't come at me for saying it like that. Because I actually speak Spanish. I'm from Mexico, so I like saying it like that. Hey, give me a sec here. Oh, maybe we can do like the uh, jalapeno poppers. Jalapeno poppers. Jalapeno poppers. What do you put on a jalapeno popper? Asking for a friend. Anyways, we we're talking. Um, how do you like your jalapeno poppers? Send me recipes. I'll do a video of versions of jalapeno peppers, poppers. That would be fun. Like, can you put meat in them? I mean, to be quite honest, I don't, I think I've had them once at a restaurant. I mean, they were very good. Not something I like go for, you know? Kind of like main meal kind of girl, you know? They're so cute. That is so fun. Where is on them? No. I have a couple small guys that don't have peppers. And I have this massive guy here. Oh my God. Wait, can you see it? Look. The size of my hand. Is that like ready? this is look at that oh that looks delicious though okay i think that's it i think that i think that was a very good haul considering it's only august so let's go tally it all up so we have the pepper we have the jalapenos an eggplant, a few more chilies, a bunch of peas, and 10 zucchinis. How cool is that? Just for today, guys. All from today. So the past couple times that I've tried to cut the grass, my blade is too dull. So I'm gonna change it today and you'll come on that adventure with me. I tried doing it a few weeks ago, but I didn't have the proper tool. So, I will today, maybe. Hopefully I can do it. Journey time! Journey time! Thank you to my brother-in-law for sponsoring this video with his breaker bar. We're gonna try it today. This is the This is the bar that I got. This is the bar that I got from Canadian Tire. You can see it there. 20 inches, blah, 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 blah. The right size, four hours. Um, this moved. Did it? There, it used to be straight. Oh yeah. Your WD-40s worked. I'm gonna have a piece of wood so I can stop the blade from moving when I'm trying to open it up. And then I have my beautiful personality. Yeah. I think those are the only things I need, so. Okay, so I'm gonna adjust this. Brad is here for support in case I need it. I think there's a storm coming. So put a piece of wood over here so the blade doesn't move whenever I'm trying to uh, take the bolt out. Oh, 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 I get it now. Oh, I get it. Okay. Get the normal ratchet now. Best brother-in-law. Best brother-in-law. 
best brother-in-law. No way, no way. Okay, so I'm just taking off the bolt. Oh, I want to add that I added a lot of special DW40 to this thing. Okay. No way. By hand? Yeah. Oh, it's super easy now once you broke it. Yeah. Wow, yeah. that's awesome. Like this. Okay, so you place this one. Oh, here, I'll show you. Okay, and I'll put this one here. The hole is slightly bigger. With the universal, um, what do you want to call it? Blade. Blade. <laughs> with, the <laughs> with the universal blade, it comes with all these extra um washers, washers or adapter things so it fits whatever you need so that's awesome mm -hmm. no because this is uh, not round that's why oh See? a shape is uh, i mean that would I, give it wait, more wait, wait. surface area right yeah like oh sorry sorry sorry, sorry. like if i did that and mm -hmm. then maybe so much more to give <laughs> you're like a christmas commercial <laughs> what do you think i think it's tight you think yep i'm gonna turn it around we'll do a test see if i still have my ankles after this and then yeah that'll be it i've learned a new skill skills okay hitting something this thing's been hit a lot so i'm i'm expecting it in this front corner here somewhere no way. oh right there. in the front that's where it got pushed in there a little bit oh because okay so we'll have to take it off and just adjust this so as far as i understand there's a little dent on the front part of the lawnmower so he's gonna dent it out fix it make non-dentless dentless dent I'm gonna look at a popsicle. So what happens when we move this up here, we torque down the, the straps too hard and bent the front wheel in a little weirdly. Uh, and then when I pulled it back out, I think I actually pulled the front in. So that's why, so I just hit it. So we're good to go now. We're gonna try again. One more. Welcome back to Rocks with Katrina, Rocks with Katrina, Rocky Katrina. It's a title in progress. So we're on the second part or the second stage of our rock tumbling. So we're gonna open the tumblers and see how everything is. Hopefully it won't rain on us. Oh my God. Ugh. Okay, then break seal. Water gray. Break the seal. Ah, oh, there it is. Okay. Gray as well. Oh, this looks like nice. Actually, like, I also forgot this for like a couple of weeks because I broke my finger and all the gross stuff is down there. So, I have to wash that really well. And then... Oh, now we're seeing a change. Right. Look. Focus. Ooh, the black one. That's nice. Oh, and this is pretty. Look. Wow. This one. 
Oh, like a bath. Fuck. Okay, I'll show you here. These are the National Geographic ones that we got. Yeah. Look at this one. The boot. Update on the boot. It's nice. The Dalmatian. Okay. Oh, this one's cute. Look at that. One more time. That. My favorite is this one, I think. This one or like this weird shaped one. Oh yeah, it's a lot different. Wait, look. So they are a lot different from the looks of them, at least. See, this one is number two. That's number one. I guess making it finer makes it lighter. I'll put six scoops on each. There you go. And then we'll fill it with water. Okay. Have the water and then we just seal it back up. So we'll put the ring part on again. In the lid on here. Okay, I think we're good and we're ready for step three pre polish. So I'll see you in seven to ten days. I said I was gonna try my peppers, so I'm gonna do that. Um, not a fan of hot peppers anymore. I have GERD. Made my first jalapeno popper. So it's not the prettiest thing, but I think it's gonna be good because I already tried them and they are really good. So anyways, if you know good recipes for these things, send them to me so I can make them because I'm gonna have a lot more peppers this year. So time to experiment. All right, so should I start with, oh, damn it. Best part just went on the floor. <sighs> so these jalapeno poppers are cream cheese and mozzarella cheese wrapped in bacon. And I know that I really like them, so I'm just gonna try one. We had them earlier today. Yeah, that's what I was saying. They're so good. I just had to go to for my first time. It's also cooked, so it's not as spicy. <clears throat> but the real deal, I was making the jalapeno poppers earlier, and somehow I did this um, right underneath my nose. Like I just did right now. And my nose was burning for like two hours. It was really, really painful. They plowed through. <laughs> I survived. Also had like a bowl of cream in my face, just like making bubbles. So imagine that. So I have two versions of my jalapenos. I don't know why this one is like this, but I'm wondering if it's spicier than like, you know, the one that's like pretty. I have cola here. Can you open that for me? Yeah, one big bite, just the whole thing. No, I can't do the whole thing. I know. And I'm afraid. Bite it. Do I have to do it with seeds? Three, two, one, bite. Oh, it's on my lips, so that's a rookie mistake. <laughs> it's a jalapeno. It's actually kind of hot. I'm gonna lie. Yeah, eh? Yeah, you wanna try? No. I give it like a four out of ten in spiciness. Oh, okay. Oh, it gets spicier in there. Yeah. <laughs> this is seven out of ten. <laughs> Right, the jalapeno, right below the Carolina Reaper, just uh, uh, sitting at a seven. Maybe a little bit of cream cheese. Yeah. 
Okay, let's do this one first. You're sure, if you want. Next. Okay, I'm gonna do this one next. The wrinkly one. The wrinkly one. <laughs> My tongue is on fire already. I, I don't blame you. This is reminding me of whenever we did the one chip challenge and you you wouldn't do it because your tummy is delicate and Alex was like, not today, and then I just died alone. Alex did say he was gonna do it and then he backed out, just to be, just to be fair, or to be uh, transparent there. Less spicy? Yeah. Some of the hot ones are close to non-hot ones. More so, bitter. So they could be- It was better. That one could have been cross-pollinated with a green pepper or something like that, and that's why it's cracked eat more. Oh, uh, better. Yeah. Ah, I... Okay, do the poblano, because that shouldn't be spicy. It'll be a good break before you get to your colorful ones. The second, uh... Oh, just to be clear, everyone, we both know that this is not going to help her, that she needs something like milk. This will, this will be cooling, I bet. Are you lying to me? No, I'm, I have no idea. I'm... Is it entre poblano? Or just poblano? I'll double check. <laughs> the poblano pepper. I'm gonna try this one next. He said it wouldn't be spicy. I don't know why I do this to myself. I don't know anything about peppers, but... This one is um, a little bit wrinkly too. So. Maybe it's maybe it's gonna be bitter. Maybe. That's not spicy. No. No spice. No. I think that might be crossbred with a green pepper. I like this one. This is great. Very soothing. <laughs> Which one are we doing first, red or yellow? I don't know. Do you want to do? Do you want to do Deadpool or Wolverine first? Oh! Bam, bam, bam. Hello, Wolverine first. Yeah. Okay. Don't eat the seeds if you can. Just eat the edge. Okay. Before we know how spicy these are. Oh, I got some uh, of <laughs> <laughs> Oh, really hot. I have popsicles. Yeah. Uh, bring all the bacon you have. Uh, uh. Oh, it's about to rain. Oh my God. Oh my God. Oh my God. Oh, that's gross. Is that that almost empty one? Yeah. Tasty. Mm -hmm. Hmm. Last one. Yeah, there's a that red one. That one's gonna be sweet, I bet. Are you lying to me? <laughs> no. Just take a big bite. Eat a, like half. Bradley Joe, do you want to go to the hospital this week? <laughs> like for me or for you? For me. Okay. Again. I wasn't sure it was a threat or a <laughs> prediction. No, like I'm taking her to the hospital. Yeah, like, like mm, uh. yeah. Here we go, the red one. Red one. Red hot. So the other one wasn't uh, spicy till you got to the seed. No, wherever there was juice. Oh, it was the juice. Okay. Mm. Yeah. I'm scared. It smell hot? No, none of them smell hot. That's a problem. Oh, that one smells good, actually. That was a big bite. Hot? Bitter? Hot! Hot? <laughs> More than the, than the red? Yo! <laughs> I just wonder why I took such a big... Yellow! More than the yellow! More than the yellow? Yeah! So the, the jalapeno was seven. The yellow was... Uh, an eight? And the red is a nine? Oh, wow. <laughs> oh, it tastes so nasty. Tastes nasty or is it just hot? Oh, the cream tastes nasty. <laughs> It was 
is the worst thing I've ever done. We finally managed to change this guy out, which was fantastic. Um, it's all cracked and bent. Uh, Katrina did a little run there with it. I mean, I'll show you a quick little whatever, but I mean, it's a new blade. It looks, it, it cuts better. It's nothing wild, but it was good. It was our first time being able to get that thing off and garden Ooh. going, which is awesome. Yeah. So finally. It's time to produce, which is really nice. Katrina's wanted to grow peppers for a long time, like the hot ones. And uh, we ended up just always having a meeting or something like that. It just didn't mm -hmm. really work out. So it's really awesome there. And then, um, yeah, this was really fun to see too. <laughs> thank you. <laughs> but thank you guys for checking us out this week. We really appreciate it. Uh, please leave a comment. You guys have been leaving comments like a bird Did just, yeah, a bird just flew up like eight feet in our house. We we brought a girl in so she could. The whole it's a whole thing. Either way, <laughs> ask she, us later. Yeah, she she's uh, she's misusing her trust or our trust with her. Okay. <laughs> But thank you so much, guys. Le leave a comment. If you're not subscribed, please subscribe. And uh, tune in for our next video coming up later this week. And please be my friend. <laughs> Bye. <laughs> uh. Rar. Look, this is Betty. She's growing up so fast now. Tell them I'm growing up so fast. Tell them subscribe to our channel. You can see me all the time. All the time. Katrina's there.